Hello guys, this is Joy. Welcome to my channel. This is a series of tutorials on Fortran programming and this is the seventh tutorial. In the previous few tutorials, we saw uh, how arithmetic operations works and in this video, we are going to see how logical and relational operations works. So, uh, logical means uh, and or not and relational means less than, uh, less uh, greater than or less than equal to greater than equal to like this. Uh, uh, it actually compares two things uh, and gives the answer whether it is true or not so, okay so first let's uh, define two variables and say uh, real variable so real a and b now, now uh, you can assign their values uh, here or you can enter the enter their values uh, on the output screen so let's uh, print uh, enter the value of a and b okay so now we have to read it so read this a and b now we are going to check certain conditions on a and b whether they are true or not and uh, fortran will tell us whether they are true or not so uh, we are going to check this condition say print uh, a equals to b okay and uh, the output will be true in t or f t stands for true and f stands for false so now just write a double equal to b so this double equal sign means uh, actually it is comparing whether a is equal to b or not okay now uh, this is how you can uh, also uh, perform other operations like this okay so whether a is greater than b for that you have to write a greater than b or a less than b then you have to write l less than if you are using the version of the fort and say f90 then uh, th this will work fine but if you are using f77 then you have to write it dot eq uh, dot gt for greater than for greater than equal to dot ge dot like this so uh, let me show you one so this is say greater than equal to then for greater than equal to we have to write it like dot ge okay so this stands for greater than equal to or for less than equal to uh, actually uh, this uh, symbolic representation and this dot g representation uh, both will work in uh, for turn 90 but uh, this symbolic representation will not work on for turn 77 so this is less than equals to now the other condition is say uh, whether a is not equal to b okay so these are the conditions we are going to check so now let's uh, build and run this program so it says uh, enter the value of a and b so let's uh, put a equal to 2 and b equal to 5 so now uh, it shows the output uh, a equal to b it's false a greater than b it's false a less than b yes it is true because 2 is less than 5 so it is true so a is uh, greater than equal to uh, b so it is false but a is less than equal to b it is true and a is not equal to b yes it is true let's check it for another values say a equal to 2 and b equal to 2 okay so now a equal to b it's true uh, and a greater than equal to b it's true and a is less than equal to b it's true and a is not equal to b so so it works fine so this is how relational operations works in fortran okay now let's see how logical operations work so for this let's define some logical variable say uh, a1 and b1 okay now define uh, say a1 equal to uh, true and b1 uh, 
equal to false okay now we are going to perform certain operations certain logical operations on a1 and uh, b1 and we will check uh, whether uh, they are true or not okay so um, say so it is print so it's a and b uh, and operations means uh, if both are true uh, say uh, if you remember the and get so if uh, both are in the high state say uh, a equal to 1 and b equal to 1 then the state is 1 and if any one of them is in the low state then the, all the outputs are 0 so this is the thing uh, that we are going to check here so a and b okay so we are going to perform a1 dot and dot b uh, b1 sorry so let's check uh, uh, so e, as a1 is equals to 2 and b1 is equals to false then the output should be false uh, because if any one of it is false then it is false okay so let's check it so the answer is false a and b it is false now what if uh, a or b okay so let's check a or b and also check uh, not a and not b so you have to write uh, this not a1 and not b1 okay now let's build and run it so a and uh, b which is false uh, a or b which is true because if any one of them is true then it is true so a uh, not a uh, which is false because here it is true so this is how and b not b is true so this is how logical operations uh, works in fortran so see you in the next video and the next video we'll see how to use conditional statements that is if and if else statements